Hey everyone, I'm Ben from the Academy of Geekery, and today guys, we are back on the Dirtville server. I've finally gotten time to make my own video on here. I am so far behind Connor. Um, but anyway, we are currently in the headquarters of the Rum K Empire. This is Upsidace's base, and yeah, it's looking pretty snazzy. Um, ooh, and he's neating this up a lot as well. See, I left this, this whole job a bit unfinished because I, I lent him a hand and decided to try and help out with the design. Yeah, so it's actually come along pretty well. I only did a couple of segments and I attempted to start work on this door, but he's done a really nice job of that and that looks really good. Good job, Zorm, okay. I, I can't use plurals properly, as you can hear. So if I just constantly mess up my English throughout this video, that's because I'm actually brain dead after exam block, which has just concluded. Um, yeah, but I guess we should probably get to work. And also, um, all this diamond armor is also courtesy to the Rum K Empire as well. I, I did not get all this. The, the, the shield is mine. That, that's about it. Oh, also, this pick is mine. <laughs> yeah, um... Like, yeah, like I said before, Alec is a long way ahead of me, and, and so I, so is basically everyone on the server since I've hardly been on. Which I'm a bit sad about, but yeah, it, I haven't been able to with all the exams and stuff, but they are over, so I have a long weekend of free time to record, as well as the school holidays which are coming up soon, so that's nice. Um, yeah, but we're going to go and pop back to my base. Now, I would normally just, like, time skip and just show you guys when I'm there, but... See, I kind of want to show you guys everything because a lot has actually changed. In fact, so much so I don't even know where I am. Where am I? Nani? Nani? That's not Alex portal. Oh, maybe you lined his portal up with the one in the overworld, finally. That'll probably do it. Also, I am going to be sipping coffee throughout the video, so just word of warning if you hear this. It probably sounds terrible. I'm sorry. Um, righty. Okay, so that's his old... <coughs> I'm not dying. That's his old portal there. Um, right, okay. Well, anyway, my base is up here. Oh, he's got a farm as well. And also, he's building, like, some sort of big base structure up there as well, which is pretty cool. Anyway, let us head back to my base. Now, this is a bit of a, um, a tedious trek, this way back to my base. Um, in fact, I don't even know if you can make it the whole way back at the moment, because last time I went down here, uh, the way across the giant lava ocean, which you will see very soon, was blown up by a ghast. So, that's fun. So, I want to block these up just because they kind of... Shoot. They kind of bother me that there's just these little gaps here. Okay, my mind is at rest now. No, no one has come back to my base. Coolio. That is a big drop. There we go. Oakley diddly, guys. We are at my nether portal. If we jump through this, I didn't get the resources for this either. This is also a courtesy of the Rum K Empire. Um, thank you very much, Alan. You're the man. Um... But yeah, so we are back on my island, and as you can probably see, a lot has changed. So anyway, down the pathway over here, which looks terrible at the moment. Um, it looks horrific, actually. I should probably neaten that up a lot. I can hear a lot of mobs. Uh, hello? I do not know where they are. Anyway. This is my little crypt thing over here. I think I might make this like a chest area or something later. It's just a dead end cave. Um, but I thought it looked pretty cool. And especially um, once these trees go back here and here. Kind of bury it a little bit more into the bush. I think that could look really cool. Shut up mobs. Righty. Just got my farm. And look. I have new flooring. I, I, I've also done the walls here, partially. Not the whole way. But yeah, th this was a little cave. For some reason I decided to fill it out with slabs. I don't actually know what's ever going to come of that little cave there. But if we head down here, I have stairs up to the next level now. And out here, whoa, whoa, look at this. I've completely renovated out the first section here. And I was really trying to go for the whole chapel thing. And I, it, it's... It doesn't look that great. Oh yeah, glass too, by the way. Um, it really doesn't look that great, but these were kind of meant to be like little 
seaty things looking forward, and this is like an altar inside the front of the chapel. I don't know, this is meant to be some sort of weird fantasy dwarven chapel. Um, no, I think it looks alright. I, I want to expand and make maybe, uh, make a tiered bit that sticks off here, like, if we destroy these four blocks here. And maybe make, like, a tower that sticks one block out forwards that goes straight up um, there and there. That could look cool, because at the moment it looks rather thin. It looks, it almost looks like a rocket. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to end up doing, really, but um, that, that's one of the few ideas I've had. Um, but I, like I said before, I haven't really had that much time to think about what I'm doing because of exam block. It's kind of consumed all thoughts recently. Um, but I'm so happy I'm free now, so I can actually get round to doing Dirtville stuff, which is awesome. Do I have a shovel? I do have a shovel. Nice. No, I don't want my shovel in my offhand. I am so unco. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to just build a quick concept for this, and then I will catch you guys back. So we have a little bit of a problem. Um, <laughs> our crafting tables are right there, and so these are probably going to end up just being a purely cosmetic kind of turret thing, because I don't actually see how else these can work. Unless we make the entrance on the second level, and then we just make like the bottom bit cosmetic. That could work. Yeah, no, no, no that could work. Let, let's, let's have a go at that. Okay, so it's been like half an hour. I've been in randomly fiddling around with stuff. Um... I have completed the front sides of the towers, obviously the inside isn't done, and uh, I've also expanded out the dirt here just to make it even with the other side, which I've also changed a little bit just so it looks a bit neater. Um, yeah, and I also added more grass and made the pathway here at the front look a bit nicer. But once again, I think that we've just totally cobblestoned out. I know we have a bit of andesite here and uh, the, the logs in there and stone slabs, but I feel like this is just way too much cobble still. Also, I'm really, really not sure about this glowstone here. I, I really don't know if I like it. Maybe my other thought I had was from... Uh, I'll need to put my cursor back on for this. Maybe from here... Oh, God damn it, weather. Go away. Uh, from here, all the way across to here, make like a beam or something of wood. So it looks like it's kind of supporting across... Me. It's a thunderstorm as well, Jesus. Go away. Uh, yeah, we have a beam going across there, um, but I don't know. I don't know what to do, to be honest. So I'm going to go take a break from doing that now, and we are going to investigate where to put my chests, because my chests uh, don't really have anywhere to live at the moment, and that's kind of been getting on my nerves. So, um, I think, like I said earlier in the video, we're going to go down and put them in the crypt. Now, sadly, we can't put them just here because this is actually, like, ridiculously close to the surface. It's, like, one block under this dirt. In fact, I think it's exactly one block under the dirt. I'm not going to try it. Um, let us go back down here, though, because... Yeah, I think maybe around here. Maybe. Could line the walls out here with some nice uh, fancy chest area. That could be cool. Um... Yeah, I'll probably have to pull it out more this direction as well. And I reckon I'll slab the way in to make it a bit easier to get in and out of. And make it look a little more like a crypt inside as well, which would be cool. And I don't know what I'll do down here. I'll think of something eventually. Anyway, I'm going to get to clearing out and planning, and I will see you guys soon. Okay guys, just running back to grab some stuff to put the finishing touches on the crypt. So I actually got really distracted and almost forgot I was recording a video. Um, it's just about done. Uh, I've just been making lots of stone here to do stone slabs and stone bricks because uh, they have ended up pretty key to doing this crypt design. Now, I've prepared this crypt uh, as if I was going to spend a lot more time down there, which I probably will, considering all my stuff is going to be there. I think eventually this front part of my base over here... Oh, whoops, that was really dumb. I don't know why I did that. Uh, <laughs> the front part of my base is going to serve solely as a cosmetic thing, and I think actually I'm going to move stuff, most of my stuff out of there eventually uh, down the back, and maybe this will become my 
actual base eventually. So as you can see, the chest room is almost done. Now it's pretty small and I know I'm going to regret that later, but for now it is good enough. It's better than just having my chests uh, in the entrance to my base, which is not particularly nice. Um, so I'm just going to make myself up some stone bricks, even though that's way more than I need. And there we go. So that's looking pretty good. So now I just need to move chests in here and, oh, I have the roof to do. Idiot. I still have to do this. Now, what shall I do for the roof? So as I was coming back in, I noticed that you can't actually see it from the outside, so I may actually leave it like that, because that's kind of cool. You come around the corner here, and then you see the inside of the crypt. And also, I'm pretty sure there's a zombie following me in here, so... I'll hide. <laughs> not here. Okay, maybe he's just not very smart. I walked straight in here, he was right... Oh no, he is there. <laughs> Go away! Go away. Go away. There we go. Nice. Oh, one of the trees... Is, both of the trees have grown. Awesome. I guess I haven't been spending that much time over here, so that's probably why they haven't grown previously. They have, the saplings were placed there quite a long time ago. There we go. Coolio. This is coming along really nicely, and I think this is actually where I'm going to wrap the video up. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. I'm sorry I wasn't particularly energetic in this video. I am so burnt out from exams. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll be a lot more energetic in the next video and uh, we'll be as productive as this one because this has actually been probably one of the most productive episodes of Dirtville I have ever done. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.